um, there'll be a tour guide and everything's going to be in French again, so you have a good chance to practice speaking the language and listening. Well, every year for French, it's open to AS and A students. Um, we run the trip to Belgium and uh, we're also able to offer some time doing work experience, but alongside that we go for visits. We change that every time we go, but this time we went to Brussels and Liège and the students had some activities organised by the Belgian students. So one of the central components to the trip is the work experience and the students could work in a variety of places. They had the choice, it's quite a long list of things, so it was everything from a florist, uh, a greengrocer's, uh, bookshops, um, children's clothes shop, um, to a primary school. Three days I worked in Pré Maman, like um, a children's clothes shop and lots of little children came in there. I worked in a florist for the three days we were there and I got to um, help sort out the flowers and unpack deliveries and it was just a very good experience. I myself worked in one of the warmest and um, coziest and friendliest bookshops I've ever had the pleasure of being in, let alone working in, and it gave me um, a sense of um, the work ethic of a traditional Belgian shop. I worked in a bookshop for three days and I served the uh, customers and I also used the computer a lot of the time in French like entering the new books in the computer and doing the returns to the other shops. I worked in the chemist, uh, well the pharmacy in the small town and um, basically because it was only a small chemist I managed to I get on well like with all the workers there and uh, I helped them make medicine. <laughs> the shop owner went out like to do to pick things up and I had to be in there on my own and like lots of people came into the shop and asked me for help and <laughs> like <"Vu -pu> <laughs> and um, I had to tell them where certain things were in the shop because I had the job to put all the clothes out and take all the clothes out of packages and put them in different places in the shop and organize everything so I knew where everything was. Every day in the shop someone would come up to me in my apron and start speaking to me in French from a random member of the public and the staff came out saying, oh no, she's, um, she's English, she's just working at the back. But it was difficult communicating with the members of staff within the shop as well because none of them spoke much English. But it was, it was, an, it was an experience, yeah. So obviously when working in the shop, like telling how the price is, that was a bit harder because you had to think of how they would say it rather than the French that you learn at college. It's like different, but once you got used to it, it was like second nature. In uh, Belgian French, uh, you would say nante as non ont, whereas in the French Stuart College, it would be uh, quatre vingt dix. So that was, you had to remember that when you were serving people, so you'd get it right. A lot of us have said that it was quite challenging at first because the local dialects can be different. But by the end of the trip, we were all talking more fluently, and we were all. And um, we at the end of the week in Brussels, we did a tour that was completely in French, and we all understood every word of it pretty much. It was really just a shock to us that how much we actually knew and how much we benefited from doing this. Um, I think it was a great success. I mean, the fact that the students have chosen already, first of all, they're going to take part again next year, but also they've arranged their own visits with uh, their host families um, to take place in the summer. But also the fact that they're, some, they're saying that by the end of the week, when we did the guided tour of Brussels, they could understand everything. And it was about architecture, it was about the history of Brussels. Um, but because they've, they've started by that point to think in the language, um, it comes so much more easily and um, they're, they're astonished at the fact that they can understand so much. That's one of the best experiences that I've like, ever had in my whole life. I'm not joking. Like, um, I've learned so much French, so much more vocabulary and my French flows. And just that experience of being with like, a family. So we all got on really well. We are planning on, in summer, uh, either we're going to go back there for three days or they're going to come stay with us again. So we're just sorting that out now. I think none of us would say we haven't benefited from this. It's all been a very like enriching experience just being there and speaking the language more. So it's really rewarding, it's really worth it.